This is the Max Preps Rivalry Series, presented by the Army National Guard. Welcome to the Max Preps Rivalry Series. I'm Alicia Powers. Today we're at the home of the Brentwood Bruins, where I'm sitting down with head coach Mike Woodward and athletic director Coach Sig. Coach, how are you doing? I'm good. How are you? Now, you were the offensive coordinator at Ravenwood from 2002 to 2005. That's correct. And now you're here at Brentwood as head coach. What is this experience like for you? You know, it's, it's been a great experience. Uh, you know, I enjoyed my time at Ravenwood, but uh, now I'm over here at Brentwood, and, you know, it's exciting to be a part of, of this rivalry. Um, it's, Brentwood is a great place to be as a teacher, as a coach. Uh, we've got great kids here, got uh, great administration, very supportive staff. So, uh, you know, it's great to be here, and I'm very excited about, you know, being a part of this from the Brentwood side. It has been a blast. Uh, not only am I the athletic director, I'm also a head coach for women's basketball and track and field. And the experience, whether it's football, whether it's a volleyball game, whether it's a, a basketball game, a softball game, a tennis match, if we were to go to the local Cracker Barrel and say we're going to have a Brentwood Ravenwood checkers match, there would be fans from both schools pour out to the outside of Cracker Barrel just to watch yet another way to com for competition. It's that fun, it's that intense. Not on the same scale as the collegiate level, but at the highest scale for a high school level. You know, it's, it's a fairly young rivalry, but I would say, you know, the last couple years maybe it's been a little one-sided. You know, Brentwood has run, won the last few years in a row. Um, but, you know, they've got some new coaches over there at Ravenwood. We know it's going to be a very tight game, very close game, and very intense, of course. So, uh, you know, it's going to be a great atmosphere and a great environment. Uh, this rivalry game uh, means a lot. Uh, being here four years, we've beaten them all the previous three years. So this uh, it's huge to get that fourth win, to never lose at Ravenwood. So that's what we're going for. Uh, the atmosphere is crazy. A uh, ton of people, always loud, normally cold. Cold weather always has an effect to it, but normally just all the fans are just nuts. Go Bruin, beat Ravenswood. Uh, this, this game means everything, especially this year. You know, this, this game is going to determine, you know, how well we do, how our season's defined, whether we get in the playoffs or not, and not to mention the fact that uh, one of our coaches from last year is over there this year. Uh, it's going to be weird, you know. I'm, Seeing him in red, you know, we've seen him in blue the past four years, and um, he's one of the guys we could always count on here. And um, he's gone now, and I'm, we respected his decision, but you know, we're ready to go hand him his first loss in Battle of the Woods. It means everything, you know. Uh, this game, I've been waiting for this game for since I was a little kid. You know, this is it's just a huge game for me, and um, something I'm probably going to remember for the rest of my life. Uh, it's been pretty busy uh, coming out to the school, getting things set up, uh, as any big rivalry game would be. So pretty busy, uh, hectic. Uh, good though. It puts me in front of front of the uh, the kids, uh, a chance to see me again, and at this time recognize me instead of having an introduction. So uh, they're excited. You know, I, I can remember back uh, a long time ago when it was uh, uh, me in their spot, uh, not here at uh, Brentwood High School, but when I was in high school. And, uh, they're excited. It's uh, it's their first, uh, some of them their first opportunity to uh, to have a big uh, event in their life. So it's it's good. The, the the game itself. I mean, that's that's the reason that we're coming out here for the kids. Uh, obviously, to have a, a presence with the guard is is always huge. But to know that the, we're supporting the community. Uh, but the game itself, it should be a good game. Uh, they've played close games in the past. Uh, not so close last year. Uh, Brentwood with a good victory. Uh, but uh, the game itself would be. Uh, uh, the most enjoyable part, I think. You know, Coach is a great guy, and I consider Will to be a good friend of mine, but, you know, when you're on the field Friday night, you know, he's an opponent, so it'll be treated just like any other Friday night. We're going to do our best to, uh, to beat his team, and he's going to do his best to, to beat ours. So it's, you know, again, there's a great deal of respect there, you know, between the two of us because we haven't known each other for so long, but on Friday night, you know, we'll be competitors. Well, interesting enough, uh, back in 2002-2003, Brentwood football won its first state championship. And then shortly after that, Ravenwood won its first state championship. And after that success at the very top, it has continued to snowball in the right direction, both positive for both programs across the board. So it's, 
it, intense, you would expect that, obviously, if we're on your radar as a rival's game. But there's some uniqueness about this because we're so close in location and all the families are so close and tied together within the community, whether it's business, church, or just best of friends. Well, what I know is going to happen is that it's going to be packed. Both stands are going to be crazy. And, you know, the kids on both sides are going to play their hearts out. You know, hopefully we play a cleaner game and don't turn the ball over, don't commit penalties to put us in a hole because, you know, Ravenwood is a very good football team and we don't need to be consistently trying to dig out of holes. We need to take care of the football, not commit penalties and kind of stay on track. Uh, Will and I have a great respect for one another now that we're colleagues. Uh, and I always respected him as a player. It will be fun before the game, but once the coin toss is up, it will be Brentwood against Ravenwood. And I won't have any trouble separating that.